having Emma at the centre of the book, you know, be um, Balakrishna, it's all told through her perspective. But even though this is the film is not told from her perspective, um, her performance and her part of the film is a really important component, I think. Are you going to work? Yeah. Mom's missing and you're going to work? Well, what do you want me to do, B? I don't know, maybe look for her? I think what in the book is B's organizational ability and all that, you don't need as much, I think, in a movie because the movie itself is doing that. The movie's holding your hand as an audience member through it. I would still say it's largely through her perspective or her angle. It's just not, as, she's not as active in actually putting this together, but she's still the, the motor to what happens in the movie to such a degree. It's her idea to go to Antarctica. It's her idea to uh, follow Bernadette. She has the information that she's there. She does a lot of the research. So she's still pushing the narrative forward, but it's not so entirely through her perspective. Well, you spent your whole life at work. Mom and I were having the best time ever. We live for each other. And she would never do anything where she'd never see me again. She wants to please both of her parents, but she has this relationship with her mom that is just so strong and different from her dad. B is just the kind of girl that is like her mom, like kind of a watered down version of Bernadette, more sane, and that's the saneness probably comes from her dad.